Hey guys, how's it going? Today I wanted to do a little tutorial to show you how to revert back to your stock launcher if you've installed something, for instance, Google Now Launcher. So if you didn't know, Google has released the Google Now Launcher, which used to be only for Nexus devices. Um, they're now pretty much available for any 4.1 device and newer. Um, so that's pretty nice to try out if you haven't. Give it a shot. It gives you that nice Nexus experience without having a Nexus phone. Um, but some of the people I've recommended it to liked it, but then realized with their HTC device, they no longer get the blink feed here. So they kind of miss out on that setup. Um, plus they didn't like the way the drawer was. They were used to scrolling up and down instead of side to side. So little, little change and stuff like that. So typically what you would do to um, revert back, besides of course uninstalling it, that's the easiest way. If you're never gonna use it, just uninstall it, go back to normal, you're fine. But if you wanna keep it and maybe revert back and forth, what you would use to do is go into your uh, settings and go down into apps, search for the app that you want. For instance, this one's Google Now Launcher. And then come down here and clear out your defaults. Well, this one, if you notice, doesn't have any defaults set, so you, there's nothing to clear out. Um, so that, that's a little bit different. At first, they were thinking they were stuck with it. They had nowhere that they can see to uninstall unless you go to the app store itself and hit uninstall. Um, so they were kind of worried that they just got stuck with this. But this is to show you how to do it if you want to keep it. So go back into your settings, come down to here where it says personalize, and then home screen. Home screen is where your launchers now reside. So if you notice, you have both Blink Feed and Google Now. If you have nothing installed, it's just going to be Blink Feed and that's just the way it is. But you can have multiple launchers if you want to try new things out and flip back and forth and see until you get comfortable. You know, it's recommended to try new stuff out, but that's how you do it. Hit Blink Feed and now, as you can see, back to normal stock scrolling is normal, everything's back to the way it was fresh out of the box. So there you go. That's how you get back to Blink Feed if you don't want to uninstall your launcher. Of course, like I said, if you want to get it uninstalled, you're never going to use it, remove it, save your space, and that's the easiest way. And you have to go into the App Store right over here and hit uninstall like normal. So that's how you do it. Any questions, comments, leave them down below. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up while you're down there. Also hit the subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, thank you for watching.